Good morning friends. I hope everyone is doing well. I request everyone to watch my videos in a sequence for better understanding. Let me read out the question. Construct a minimal DFA where alphabets A comma B for a long with L contain strings whose length is exactly divisible by 4. Let's take that I have taken a string X which belongs to long with L. And if I calculate the length of it, and if I divide it by 4, I should get the remainder as 0. That is what the st statement it is saying. If L x is a string which belongs to long with L, and if you are calculating the length of it, and if you divide it by 4, you should get the remainder as 0. So, what are the strings whose length is exactly divisible by 4? One is that whose length is 0, the strings whose length is 0, the strings whose length is 4, the strings whose length is 8, 12, 16, so on, are the strings which will be belongs to long with L. So, first let me find out what are the strings whose length is exactly 0 is epsilon. Of length 4, you will get 16 combinations. So, what are some of them I will write. We will get like A, 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 B, A, A, B, A, 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 B, B. Like that you will get 16 and with two power, with length 8 you will get 2 power 8 strings. Of length 12 you will get 2 power 12 strings. Of length 16 you will get 2 power 16 strings. So on you will get. So what I can say about this long ways? This long ways L is an infinite long ways. If the long ways is an infinite long ways, there may be a DFA or there may not be a DFA. If a DFA is available, what is the DFA? We will check it now. So first they are saying that it should accept the strings whose length is 0. So initial state is Q0. When I can say that Q epsilon is accepted, if it is in the, if your initial state is acting as a final state, then I can say that it is accepting a, the epsilon. How? Suppose if I want to say that AA is accepted, how can I say that from the initial state, by traversing the AA, you should reach the final state. Am I right? In this case, I want to accept epsilon. Epsilon is nothing but there is nothing. It is an empty string. So from the initial state, by taking an empty string, if you want to reach to the final state, then obviously your initial state should act as a final state. Okay. Then I cannot accept of length 1. Am I right? So my Q1 will not act as a final state because it should accept of length 1. 2 it will not accept, of length 2 it will not accept, okay, of length 3 it will not accept, then length 4 it should accept, we will check it, I have constructed the DFA, we will check it whether it is right or wrong, now AAA should be accepted, we will check it whether AAA is accepting or not, I am in the initial state Q0, okay, if I traverse from initial state on A, I will go to a state called Q1 because Q0 on A, you are going to Q1. Q1 on A, I am going to Q2. Q2 on A, I am going to a state called Q3. Q1 on A, I came to Q2. Q2 on A, I came to Q3. Q3 on A, I am going to Q0. So, from the initial state, after traversing the entire string, I have reached to a state called Q0. What is the Q0? Q0 is a final state. So what I can say, this string AAA was accepted by the DFA whatever you have constructed. Okay, let me take another example to verify it. ABAB. ABAB, does it belong to long ways L? Yes, it belongs to long ways L. Why? Because the length of the string is 4 and 4 is exactly divisible by 4. So we will check it. Q0 on A is going to Q1. Q1 on A, oh sorry, not Q1 on B, it is going to a state called Q2. Q2 on A, Q2 on A, it is going to a state called Q3. Q3 on B, it is going to a state called Q0. So finally, you have reached a state called Q0, which is a final state. So what I can say? The string ABAB is accepted by the DFA and which belongs to long with L. So we will take an another counter example. Means which is 
string which does not belong to language L. So let me take a simple example A B A. A B A whose length is three. Whether three is divisible by four? No, because it will give the remainder as three for me. Okay. So Q naught on A, it will go to Q one. Q one on B, it will go to state called Q two. Q two on A, it is going to a state called Q three. So I have reached a state called Q three. Whether Q three is a final state? No, it is a non-final state. If you have reached a non-final state, then what you can say? The string is not acceptable by the DFA. So we have verified that what are the strings which belongs to long base L was acceptable by this DFA, and what are the strings which does not belongs to long base L is not acceptable by the DFA. Then what I can say? This DFA is a correct DFA for the given question. And we need to check even before that only I need to check whether it is complete DFA or not. It is a complete DFA. Is it clear? If you say that Q naught on A and B, you have a transition. Q one on A and B, you have a transition. Q two on A and B, you are going to Q three. So there is a transition. Q three on A and B, you are going to Q naught. So there is a transition. So I can say that it is a complete DFA and it is minimal DFA for the given question. I hope you have understood the video. If you have not understand the concept, yeah, I request you to watch the video again for better understanding. Thank you so much.